Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm super excited because I just got the Muse Tarot in the mail, right here. And I haven't taken it out of the box yet, so I thought I would hop on and do a quick unboxing and walkthrough for all of you so we can look at all of the cards together. Um, I'm super excited because I have literally been Instagram stalking Chrisanne for I don't know how long and I feel like I've been waiting for this package for 5,000 years so I'm so so excited I just knew I had to have this deck as soon as I saw it <clears throat> um, I just love everything about it anyway without babbling on for too long let's just dive into it so it just came in a standard box and it's really cute because she like drew little hearts and stuff on the side of the box and then we have okay a card for the digital guidebook. And then, oh, she sent an extra Empress card. Look at how beautiful that is. Oh my God, I'm in love, so in love. Yeah, so this is just sitting at the top there. I love it. Oh, and then also a print here. I think this is, the Knight of Wands? I can't remember which card this is, but we'll find out. And then there's a little note from her on the back, which is really sweet. The Muse of I Am. So here's this extra card. And then we have the little um, title card. So on this side of the card, she explains the four suits, which are inspiration, emotions, voices, and materials. So the suit of inspiration corresponds to wands, emotions corresponds to cups, voices to swords, and then materials to pentacles. And then it says the muses are the kings. Every piece in this box is just so freaking beautiful. Okay. So that's it for the extra cards, and then now let's just do a quick walkthrough of the different cards in this deck.
right guys, so that's it for the walkthrough. I am so in love with this deck. I feel like you can just tell how much love and care was put into the creation of this deck. Um, a couple of things that I noticed is all the Muse cards, which are the equivalent of like the Kings, um, are horizontal, like landscape instead of portrait, which I think is really interesting. And mystery solved, this print is the Knight of Materials or the Knight of Pentacles. And then the last thing that I noticed is actually the Empress card that I pulled out of the box first actually is a replacement for the Empress card that's in the deck because there's a numbering error on this deck here. See, it's the Empress is number two in the deck. So this one has the correct number on it. And that's why that card is in there. But that's okay, I'm still happy to have an extra Empress to admire. Um, yeah, so overall I really, really love this deck, obviously. I'm just, these are very, very first impressions, but I just think it's beautiful. The color palette makes me happy. <laughs> it's just really beautiful and the cardstock is really great quality. It feels really nice in your hands and I'm just really happy to have this deck. I love it. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this walkthrough um, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.